hello you're welcome how to solve this nice exponential equation solution from here and what we have here we take the right hand side to left hand side as what we have becomes x raised to power 6 minus into brackets x minus 2 or raised to power 6 then equals to 0 here the next step we can write this as x raised to power 3 then all raised to power 2 as 2 times 3 here give us 6 minus. Also, here we have x minus 2, or raised to power 3, then or raised to power 2 equals to 0 here. Then this follow when we have a square minus b square is same thing as a plus b into brackets, then open brackets a minus b. That is here, a standing as x raised to power 3 and b standing as x minus 2 or raised to power 3. That is what we have here follow this and becomes x raised to power 3 plus into bracket x minus 2 or raised to power 3 into brackets and also x raised to power 3 minus into bracket x minus 2 or raised to power 3 plus brackets then equals to 0 here then we have two possible cases the first one x raised to power 3 plus into bracket x minus 2 or raised to power 3 equals to 0 or x raised to power 3 minus into bracket x minus 2 or raised to power 3 equals to 0 that is Solving on this side, this follows when we have a raised to power 3 plus b raised to power 3 is the same thing as a plus b into brackets, then open brackets a square minus a b plus b square. That is, this follows what we have and becomes x plus x minus 2 into brackets, then open brackets. Here we have x square minus x times x minus 2 then plus x minus 2 or square plus bracket equals to 0 here that is this bracket give us 2x minus 2 into brackets and open bracket here we have x square then minus x open this bracket we have minus x square then plus 2x then plus expansion here give us x square minus 4x plus 4 plus brackets and equals to 0 here that is here we have 2x minus 2 into brackets and open brackets here x square minus x square cancel each other we have x square left then 2x minus 4x equals minus 2x, then plus 4 plus bracket equals to 0 here. Which implies here we have two possible cases 2x minus 2 equals to 0, or we have x squared minus 2x plus 4 equals to 0. Watch this video to the end, give it a thumbs up, put your comments, share this video. And also subscribe. Solving on this side, we have two x equals to two. Then divide both sides by two here. Yet two cancel each other. We have x I equals to two over two. That gives us one. That is x equals to one here. Then also solving on this side, we have a quadratic equation. We are here equals to one. V equals to minus two. And c equals to 4. Applying the quadratic formula, which is x equals to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac all over 2a. That is, here we have x equals to minus minus 2 plus or minus square root of minus 2 square minus 4 times 1 times 4, then all over 2.
that is we have x equals to minus 10 minus is plus this give us plus 2 and plus or minus square root of minus 2 square that's 4 minus here we can still leave it at 4 times 4 then all over 2 the next step this becomes x equals to 2 plus or minus square root of 4 is common here. We factor it out. We have 4 into brackets. Here we mean 1 minus 4, close bracket, all over 2. That is, we have x equals to 2 plus or minus square root of 4 times 1 minus 4 is minus 3, all over 2. Then, here follows when we have root a times b, which can be separated as root a times root b. That is, here we can write this as x equals to 2 plus or minus root 4 times root minus 3 all over 2. That is, here we have x equals to 2 plus or minus root 4 is 2, then root minus 3, that's root 3 half over 2. Then here, we factor 2 up here, we have 2 into brackets, 1 plus or minus root 3 high left all over 2. Here 2 cancel each other. We have x equals to 1 plus or minus root 3 high. Here we have two complex solutions here. Then, solving from the second case here, this follows when we have a raised to power 3 minus b raised to power 3, which is the same thing as a minus b into brackets. Open brackets a square plus a b plus b square. That is, yeah, all oh, we have follow this and becomes x minus b and b is x minus 2. So we have to be careful here. So this minus we affect x minus 2 then close brackets. Then, yeah. We now have a square that's x squared now, then plus x multiplied by x minus 2, then plus b square, which is x minus 2 or square, close bracket equals to 0 here. That is, yeah, minus open this bracket. All that becomes into bracket x minus x, then plus 2. Close brackets. Then also here we have into brackets x square plus x open this bracket. We have x square minus 2x. Then the expansion here gives us plus x square minus 4x plus 4. Close bracket equals to 0 here. Then here yeah, x minus x cancelled out. We have 2 left here, then times. Here we have x square plus x square plus x square equals 3x square minus x minus 4x minus 2x minus 4x equals minus 6x then plus 4 close bracket equals to 0 here. Then this 2 here is a constant. When we divide through by, divide both sides by 2. That is, we divide by 2 here. What we have here becomes 3x squared minus 6x plus 4, then still equals to 0 here. That is, here also we have a quadratic equation where a equals to 1, b equals to minus 6, and c equals to 4. And when we apply the quadratic formula, here we have x equals to minus minus 6 plus or minus square root of minus 6 square minus 4 times 1 times 4 then all over 2 times 1 then sorry here yeah. coefficient of x squared that's a so a is 3 Excuse me, so this will be 3, then also 3 here. Okay, we have been used to one. Sorry about that. All right, then next step here, 
we have x equals to minus times minus become plus. So we have plus 6 and plus or minus square root of minus 6 squared give us 36 and minus 4 times 3 times 4. We have minus 48 over 2 times 3, that's 6. That is, yeah, this becomes x equals to 6 plus or minus square root of 36 minus 48. That's minus 12 all over 6. Which also we can write as x equals to 6 plus or minus square root of 4 times 3 times minus 1 or over 6. And when we separate this root 4, that's 2, we take it out and we have x equals to 6 plus or minus 2. Then we have root 3, root minus 1 is i over 6. Then yeah, 2 is common hope and we have x equals to 2 into brackets, 3 plus or minus root 3 high, then over 6. And here 2 goes here 1, 2 goes here 3. And what we have becomes x equals to 3 plus or minus root 3 i over 3. That is, we have also two complex solutions here. Therefore, all together here, we have five solutions in this problem. One real solution. Two complex solutions here, two complex solutions here. Making five solutions together. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos. Turn the notification bell. Share this video with a thumbs up with your comments. And see you next class. Bye for now.